honestly, the mantra is enablement. Now, change management is not easy, and it's important to understand who your colleagues are and what their different personalities and practices are. With any new technology, you always have a group that are always receptive to trying any new tool, but on the opposite end, you might have someone that is very reluctant to change and are already cemented in their workflow. So it's about capturing, say, the middle 50% that can give you an opportunity to change their workflow for the better. And we do that by offering low touch to high touch spectrum of opportunities. So on the low touch side, we provide periodic emails and surveys and even wow cases showing the impact of AI. And the opposite end, we offer office hours and one-to-one -one time with radiologists and myself to then go through the solution to make sure that they fully understand its capabilities and answer any questions that they may have. It's all about breaking barriers and making sure that education is at the forefront so that there's no question about someone not knowing what the solution was or what it could potentially do, but rather breaking down and dispelling any myths about it to make sure that the AI is incorporated in a way that can improve their workflow. So I'd like to say that having accessibility to this data is crucial not just for the monitoring perspective for these products, because it is important to be mindful of the potential performance degradation and data drift that's inevitable with AI solution. But the second half of being, the, being able to analyze this data in order to determine where there's been an impact. So for us, I think especially where we were able to showcase immediate wins was the efficiency impact with identifying critical findings faster than we previously could and of course, reporting those to the ordering providers. By calculating the time to dictate the, the, the solution and the positive result, as well as the time to reporting it to the ordering provider, as well as the time to intervention, where we were able to demonstrate appreciable gains in reducing the time to actually take action on potentially life-threatening uh, issues. But I'd like to highlight one solution where we were able to make a great impact when it came to reporting efficiency gains. One of our solutions is a generative AI tool that automates our impression from the findings in the report. We, I was able to then calculate data from one of our more efficient radiologists in the group and demonstrate that they were able to make some sizable gains in efficiency. And now this is someone who is already well respected in our practice and the fact that they were able to make improvement was a really strong motivator for others to then jump in which is great for me because it creates a positive feedback loop. I've now convinced other radiologists to start using the tool and now I have new data pre-AI and post-AI to then analyze and then showcase at one of our subsequent monthly staff meetings to then share with them the impact and efficiency gains they've made. And that's sort of an, that is the enablement that goes a long way in encouraging others to take the leap and start using an AI solution. For me, it's been the level of enthusiasm. At first, I expected people to be quite resistant to new AI solutions because in theory, there was concern about making it parts of our job obsolete and in theory, replacing us. But obviously we all know that that's not the case. AI is an adjunct to our workflow and it's a matter of leveraging these tools to remove more of the litigious and taxing parts of our job so that we can focus on providing patient care and interpreting images. So that, that has been quite uh, a refreshing perspective and it gives me more pride and ownership in making sure that I'm proactively selecting and finding solutions that can make an impact. I think people are burnt out, they're overworked, the imaging volumes are exploding and in any which way where I can find where I can provide relief is a great privilege.